The word is out at Hampton University this Thursday. Vice President Kamala Harris is making the trip from Washington, D.C. to campus grounds to meet with HU students. It's the beginning of a month long national tour. Now it's Little Hales reports from the university on the campus's energy and what we know so far about the visit. Students are a buzz over a vice presidential visit. Thursday, the vice president of the United States of America is coming to the real HU. It's a little different because of who she is. First female vice president and um, she is a person of color. So it's an honor and a privilege to honestly be this close to her. Two years after a STEM roundtable in 2021, Vice President Kamala Harris kicks off a nationwide campus tour starting with Hampton University. According to White House officials, Thursday's visit begins a circuit across public schools and HBCUs discussing fundamental rights and freedoms. This includes discussion on abortion rights, gun safety, climate change, voting rights, and more. Answer questions with her, it's like more Q&As now. So there's more opportunities to get one-on-one -on -one and personal with her. Years ago when Vice President Harris was here, we didn't necessarily have that opportunity because only a small group of students from the STEM related programs were allowed to go into the building with her. Lillian Carr, HU student government president, will be the one to introduce Harris to her campus, this time to a much larger audience without the obstacle of the COVID-19 pandemic. Something that we talked about specific to Hampton was mental health and stress and just being a student and how exactly that looks and plays into our day to day. Harris's visit to HU two years ago consisted of only a handful of students. But this time, the SGA president here at HU says that they expect to fill Ogden Hall with roughly 1,200 students and staff. In Hampton, I'm Alex Little-Hales for 13 News Now.